Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Turbo here. My video today is going to be online dating 101. Now, this is a video for those who are completely new to the online dating or some of you guys might have had been online dating for a while but not you're not getting the, quite the results that you want. So, I hope these tips will help you with it. Okay, now I suppose now that you have download the dating apps to your phone and if you're in Thailand like me I recommend Tinder and Badu as for Tinder the most of the you you find most of the hot girls and the Instagram look like models they they're usually on Tinder but as for the Badu app is usually the, the the girls on the Badu app is like the home girl looking like the girl next door looking it's that kind of vibe so <clears throat> It depends on what your preference is but I would just get both of them and now that you downloaded the apps to your phone it's time to set up your profile okay just fill them out the most important thing about the profile is the, of course the pictures you want to upload at least four to five pictures it's better to have more and you will want pictures of a close-up you know some close-up pictures where like as you can see me in this video where they can see your face properly and you want some pictures of yourself standing up where they can see you from head to toe and guys keep your shirts on okay you, you don't want to be like I know some of you have worked hard to get that six-pack and you're dying to show it to the world but uh, usually that shit turns women off it comes off as you're trying too hard or right? you're trying too hard and another recommendation from me is don't post pictures of your possessions like the car you drive or you might have a rolex that you want to show but don't don't do that right that, that's a big turn off for women by the way here's the thing when you do that when you post pictures of the possessions you own on dating apps it sends a message that uh, I'm not good enough to get a date so if I show you what I own you might be interested you understand what I'm saying so you don't want to do that now uh, now that you've got your all your uh, pre pre profile pictures uploaded to the dating apps it's time to get to swiping now it, when you're on dating apps in Thailand, right, you will notice that you will come across a lot of lady boys, and a lot of lady boys, most of them are, are prettier than the real women, but 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 they usually they will they will tell you on the profile pictures that um, they are lady boys and and they transgender, transgender. So if you care to read that, but if that's your thing, then man, knock yourself out. We we all have different tastes. I'm not trying to judge nobody here, but as for my personal opinion, I would go with Ted. There are no such thing as chicks with dicks, only guys with tits. Uh, <laughs> right, and another thing you will come across on dating apps are the complicated women. What I mean by that is the, the women who set their relationship status as complicated. Now, I don't fuck with complicated pussy. You don't want to be fucking with complicated pussy. It's just not worth it. And it could actually get you killed. I'm serious now. You do not know what kind of guy she still has an attachment to. You know, her ex-boyfriend, ex-husband. You don't know what kind of people they are. And I know that, you know, Thailand is the land of smiles. People are friendly. That is true. But you do not want to be ending up in bad situation with the wrong people. I've seen it on the news, it has happened before, people getting shot over this shit, so... Mm -hmm. There ain't no pussy worth risking your life for, alright? Now... Uh, now that you've got a uh, couple of matches, I, I would just recommend you get a few matches. And here's how you start texting them. For me, what works for me is, I always keep the text short. Don't ask them too much. You ask a few questions like, hey, what's your name? Where are you located? And what do you do for the weekend? Would you like to grab lunch sometimes? Would you like to 
get a cup of coffee sometimes if the girl say yes then you, then you say okay then i'll hit you up later and you move on to find more prospects see as for for the women the, the girls the women they will know instantly by looking at your pictures they will they will know instantly if they want to meet you or not so you really don't have to be texting all day it um it it comes off as needy you do not want to over pursue and i want you guys to get a few matches and be talking to at least three or four girls at a time so in that way you are your attention is divided all right and you don't come off as needy okay now that's it for this video i'll see you boys later